What's up, y'all? This is your boy DJ EI coming to you today from my kitchen with what might very well be one of the best ideas I have ever had in my entire life. Now, we're going to be stepping away from the turntables today, but that's still not going to stop me from bringing you guys one hell of a mashup that's guaranteed to rock your socks. And without further ado, I present to you guys the A&W Big Mac Challenge. Now, what we got here is just your standard everyday dirty old McDonald's Big Mac. And what we got here is a couple of A&W burgers, like so. Now, if you're anything like me, you love Big Macs. But every time you bite into one of those puppies, you think to yourself, Jesus Christ, what the hell is this? What, what are these pathetic looking patties on this beast? Look at this, look at this thing. See that? That's disgusting. So what we're doing today is we're getting rid of them shits, right? Just like so. We're keeping all the same mac toppings that you all love. That mac sauce. You know you love that mac sauce. And then we're taking a couple of A&W burgers. Look at that puppy. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. And we're putting them shits on there instead. Look at that. Throw this back on here like this. And then we're going to take this. And we're going to take this. Another patty. Bada boom. Look at that beast. Now, that is a very Big Mac. Now, I'd be lying if I said this shit wasn't a little bit wasteful, but those are the breaks when you want to have a burger that looks like that. Look at this thing. Look at that. You see that? Now that is what a Big Mac should look like, but does not. Now, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take a big bite out of this thing, let you know what I think. Um, yeah, I'm excited. This couldn't have come too soon because I'm starving. So check this out. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. Oh my god. So, first impressions. You've got all the delicious spices that come in an A&W patty. If you've ever had A&W burgers, you know what I'm talking about. Their patties have some kind of delicious seasoning in them that I can't exactly put my finger on. But then you combine that with, hold on, I need another bite. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. 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 So you combine those seasonings with the mac sauce and all the other delicious Big Mac toppings, all stacked up double on a sesame seed bun, and you've got yourself a very Big Mac. Yo, that's a baller burger. I'm not gonna lie, I just sat in two drive throughs to make this burger happen, and it was probably in the neighborhood of $15 Canadian, but this is one beast of a burger. What a hell of a thing. Everybody, I implore you, get out and get yourselves a very big Mac. Boom. Ah, puppy. Peace.